Yeah, boys, a lot cooler than it's been. Makes it nice on the walk in. You're not a ball of sweat right when you first get there. Don't know if I've been mentioning it yet here. Uh, I'm using my new uh, Patriot, the Woodman Arms Patriot. Uh, I switched over the 45 caliber. Mark and the boys have uh, tested and I guess some sabots that uh, the groups you get with this thing is unreal. I had the 50 cal and there's nothing wrong with it. I mean, it's great. Uh, I just wanted to try something that they've been working on a little more. And if you haven't bought either one, I, I kind of like the 45 loop. It seems to be a little more accurate for me. <clears throat> can have a lot of guys tell me I'm crazy. I've been called worse. <laughs> but these Patriot uh, muzzle loaders are unreal. Uh, can't wait to see what it does here to this bear. Nice. The Reaper does it again. pretty cool he 
walking in there. I'm going to say he's at least 180, maybe 200 pounds, but I got a good bear last year, so I didn't want, I wanted something bigger. I could have blasted him with a, my Patriot muzzle loader. We get some pretty good footage of him, but it's starting to get dark down in there, so at the point where I couldn't, uh, couldn't get the footage. Uh, it was just too blurry. So, I could have stayed another 10, 15 minutes. Uh, I could still see, easy. But if you can't get the footage, that's what we're trying to do is get some, you know, get the, uh, get film the hunt. So, I had to back out, unfortunately. Uh, he's a good bear. Uh, tall, he's a little short. So, my guess he's, I guess he's 200, but he might fool me either way, 20 pounds. Um, but it's only the third night of the hunt. It's pretty awesome. We'll, uh, we're going to keep hunting. i got to put, put one down on my muzzle over here. So I'm anxious to try that. So we'll keep on going. Someone hold that. Right. Right. Okay, not that yeah, there you go, Wyatt. You're doing something right.